Welcome to www.texas.healthsourcecairo.com slash city slash Burleson. Today's topic, how to prevent and treat headaches in children. When a child is hurting, there's a sense of urgency that creeps up, a wanting to make the pain go away. This is easier in cases of a scraped knee or other minor issue, but when the pain is a result of a headache, many parents are at a loss. We know what we do for our own headaches, pain reliever, and if we're lucky, a nap. The prevention of a headache is always the preferable choice. There are many factors that could cause a headache in a child. Many of them are the same triggers that many adults experience as well. Sleep, or the lack of it, is often a contributor. It is important for a child's overall health to get at least 8 to 10 hours of sleep on a nightly basis. A regular sleep schedule will also help to prevent childhood headaches. Some headaches in children are triggered by diet. Allowing a child to eat an unbalanced diet or to even skip meals on a regular basis can often lead to headaches. This is because missed and unbalanced meals will cause low blood sugar. Healthy snacks in between meals will also help to avoid headaches caused by low blood sugar. Another sometimes overlooked reason for headaches in children is dehydration. It is so important for kids to stay hydrated, especially during sports or in hot weather. Sometimes water just isn't enough. When a child is exerting lots of energy, try sports drinks. These contain electrolytes that help to keep their bodies hydrated. If the child is having this issue on a regular basis, keep a diary of what was happening. For example, stress, foods eaten, etc. This will be helpful for a doctor to see and will help with the diagnosis. What if all of these preventive measures do not work and the child develops a headache regardless? Is treating a childhood headache any different from treating one in an adult? Basically, yes. The first step that should be taken when a child complains of a headache is to administer pain medication. This will normally be an over-the-counter that's made especially for children. Be sure to follow the manufacturer's directions as well as any instructions that may have been given by the doctor. If the child has skipped a meal, have them eat something healthy. A piece of fruit or some juice will help to raise the blood sugar quickly. This may help alleviate the headache symptoms long enough for the medicine to start to work. If at all possible, encourage the child to lie down in a darkened, quiet room. Sleep may not be necessary, however, closing the eyes and lying still may help lessen the headache symptoms for the child. If this isn't feasible, have the child sit in a chair with their head back or sometimes in your lap. This can also help the situation. If the child is complaining of headaches on a frequent basis and these tips do not seem to be helping, schedule a doctor's visit to be sure that there's nothing serious that needs to be addressed. For more information on topics like this, go to www.texas.healthsourcecairo.com slash city slash Burleson.